India's popular right-wing Prime Minister Narendra Modi has been re-elected but lost the majority in a shocking upset. 73-year-old Modi had vowed that his right-wing nationalist Bharatiya Janata Party or BJP would win by a huge majority. But the BJP ended up winning only 240 seats, falling short of the majority of 272 seats in the 543-member parliament. Results showed on Tuesday, June 4th. Meanwhile, a group of opposition parties known as the India Alliance did much better than expected and won a total of 233 seats. The coalition is made of more than 20 national and regional parties which had come together for the first time with the sole aim of defeating Modi. In his 10-year tenure, Modi has been praised for pushing for gender equality and for launching several initiatives to boost rural development. But he has also been accused of spreading hate speech against Muslims in the country and eroding democracy by cracking down on opposition and independent media. The BJP was still able to secure a majority and keep Modi as the Prime Minister by forming a coalition with other partner parties. This was the world's largest election with more than 642 million people voting between April 19 and June 1st in seven phases. Speaking in his victory address in the capital New Delhi, Modi thanked all his supporters for bringing him back to power for a third consecutive term, calling it a victory for the world's largest democracy. He said that the BJP will leave no stone unturned in fulfilling all their promises. Follow for more stories from around the world.